Hey everybody, it's Katura K here and I am here today to show you all another video on my Irresistible Me hair extensions. Today I'm going to be showing you all how to achieve the half up, half down look. You can either do the half up ponytail or the half up bun with the rest of your hair hanging down. I'm going to link all the information down below so if you're interested in purchasing, just drop down to that description box and I'm also going to include a coupon code for you all. So if you're interested in watching, stay tuned. So like I already have these extensions in, I'm just going to take out what I already have in up at the top. At the bottom, I'm going to keep them in and if you want to see how I apply the bottom, head on over to my first video. So I'm going to be taking these off, taking these out. And they're so easy to take out, literally. You just unclip and slip. <laughs> That's all. Unclip and slip. So I think that's enough hair for the half up area. I'm gonna take out the four clip, the thicker one. I'm probably gonna use that at the top. And I'm gonna go back and add one of my two clips. And I'm gonna add two of those back here for more fullness. See how easy it is? I'm doing it with one hand, just like that. And I'm gonna repart my hair here and cover up the tracks there. You can probably do a little bit more if you wanted to, just to cover up everything. So I'm gonna take a hair bow and basically put my hair up in a ponytail at the top. Everything, like I said, everything back here is gonna stay. And I'm gonna take that and put it in a high ponytail. Just like that. You can make it as high as you want. Just do it just like that. And I'm gonna be taking that four weft for clip track and I'm going to be going around that ponytail. I'm going to start right here and kind of in the back and slide, drop, hit them both, I'm stop. I'm going to keep going and clipping it, just making sure you're clipping some parts of the hair just so it won't move. And I'm going to keep going around. This is the back side. You want it to be kind of as close as possible to the, um, to your natural ponytail. Just so it won't look so boxy. Just like that. And that's where I got it clipped all around that ponytail. So now I'm gonna take a piece of hair at one of the ends. At one of the ends like this. And I'm gonna grab a piece of hair just like that. And I'm gonna take it around just to cover up that track right here. Just like that. And you're gonna be able to wrap it around a couple of times. And you can take a box to secure it, which I don't have one on me. But as long as you wrap it around enough, you should be fine. But I'm probably gonna put one in there. But that you wanna hold it at the base and then brush so it's not pulling at the clips. So that is really all you can go over your natural hair along with the extensions just for more just for a better blend just like that 
I don't like to put too much heat in my hair, as you all know. And um, yeah, so I just want to keep it light and just try to keep them blended as nice as possible. You can also make it into like a bun by taking, wrapping it around just like this. Try to make it a little bit neater than what I'm doing, but yeah, that's better right here. And take it, wrapping it around. And you can also go in and secure that also. You can always go in and position the hairs and pin them just like that, kind of. And it takes a Just like that. Just like that. And you can always go back and brush up your hair. My hair gets really strandy when I put it up and stuff is going back and forth, rubbing against it. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're interested in purchasing these irresistible knee clip and extensions, then just click the link down below. I also have a special coupon code for you all so y'all can save some cash. And yeah, I'll definitely see you all in my next video. Bye.